Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today, I'm going to be showing you how to install Lineage OS 20 on the Redmi Note 7 Pro. Lineage OS is a custom ROM that's based on Android, and it's one of the most popular custom ROMs available. It's known for being fast, stable, and feature-rich. Before you start, you'll need to make sure that you have the following. A Redmi Note 7 Pro with an unlocked bootloader. A custom recovery installed on your Redmi Note 7 Pro. The Lineage OS 20 ROM for the Redmi Note 7 Pro. A USB cable to connect your Redmi Note 7 Pro to your computer. The first thing you need to do is download the Lineage OS 20 ROM. For the Redmi Note 7 Pro, you can download the ROM from the Lineage OS website. I will give the direct link for the download in the descriptions. So, please do check it out. If you don't already have a custom recovery installed, on your Redmi Note 7 Pro, you'll need to install one. There are a number of different custom recoveries available, but I recommend using TWRP or Orange Fox Recovery if you don't have a Windows PC. If you are running Linux, you will not be able to install this super empty image file. As of now, you can only run wipe super system command on Windows PC using platform tools. I have installed the ROM on Windows 11, but somehow I can't record the video on it. I have installed the ROM using Lineage OS 20 Recovery. We will flash it first. After flashing the recovery, go to the wipe section and wipe the data partition and system partitions. After wiping both partitions, just boot your phone into the fast boot mode again and flash the super empty image using the following command. As I already mentioned, you can't run this command on Linux PC. For this command, you need platform tools on your Windows PC to run this command. Or you can directly flash super empty image using TWRP or Orange Fox Recovery. After flashing the super empty image, reboot into the recovery and flash the Lineage OS 20 zip file. After completing the installation process, just reboot your phone into the system. The installation process will take one to two minutes to boot, so be patient. So this is it for this video. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.